Guard up. It's time. Right. You bastards are done. <laughs> That's what you get for not being more careful. But yeah, Bardock. Guess we went pretty hard, celebrating your son's birth and all. Celebrating my son's birth? <laughs> sure, whatever. We're done here, so you should head back to planet Vegeta and see the little tyke. Why the hell would I waste my time with that pathetically hopeless pipsqueak? What kind of fool do you take me for? Count me out. <laughs> Suit yourself. You know, guys, we ought to thank Lord Frieza. He's been treating us good for a long time now. But what's Lord Frieza want with a dump of a planet like this anyway? Well, supposedly, there's some sort of weird psychic energy on this rock. At least, that's the rumor anyway. Not sure if Lord Frieza really believes that, but... I hear he's been after it for quite a long time now. He caught me off guard. Hear me? Just now, I've hit you with my fabled future punch technique. You should now see that you and your kind are doomed. Future punch? What the hell are you talking about? There is nothing, nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out. Just like what happened to us. How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered. <laughs> That's enough! <laughs> huh. What a joke! The Saiyan race is unbeatable. That guy honestly thought we'd suffer? Give me a break. Hey, Bardock. Bardock! Hey, Bardock! Snap out of it! Bardock! The hell's wrong with you? What are you doing? Bardock! Lord Freezer. We've just received word that planet Kanasa is ours. Good. That puts us about one month ahead of schedule. So who did it? 
Who is in charge of clearing out that place? A band of insignificant low-class Saiyan warriors. Saiyans? Those guys have been putting in the work lately. Some of them are indeed remarkable. Take that Prince Vegeta, for example. He possesses a power level well beyond his years. And that's not all. Individually, they don't amount to much, but in large numbers, they can have immense power. <laughs> you sound scared of them, Zarbon. <laughs> Hardly. But they could prove to be a nuisance if we don't do something about them. I mean... There's no telling when another Vegeta will show up. And if enough of them were to rally behind a Saiyan like that... They would become a thorn in my side? Oh, uh, indeed. So, how's he doing? Well, physically speaking, he's completely healthy. But his brainwaves are another matter. Nothing we can do about it. I guess Bardock's gonna have to sit this one out. Wh what? What happened to me? What the hell's going on? There is nothing. Nothing but annihilation in your future. You will all be wiped out. Just like what happened to us! How does it feel knowing the future? Knowing that your days are numbered! <laughs> Bardock! You've awakened! Hold on, I'll open the capsule for you. What the hell was that just now? A dream? No, it was different. It felt so real. A planet blowing up. A pod heading for a blue planet. Who was that kid? What a bunch of crap. He seemed to be having a nightmare. Are you okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm built better than guys like you. Where are Tora and the others? They were dispatched to Planet Meat under the orders of Lord Frieza. What? Damn it! I can't believe they left me behind! Planet Meat, huh? That's not far. All right. Wait, wait! Bardock! Your days are numbered. Kakarot. A power level of two. Garbage. 